uh, the, the challenge of the, the Maryland big man. As far as when you guys advance, of course, the team can get better. Personnel gets better. Talk about that. You know, the Maryland guards. Yeah, they're very talented. They got a lot of bigs with great size, very skilled around the hoop. Um, and it's good. You know, we just started watching some tape on them. I've been able to see them a couple times throughout the year. But, um, you know, they're, they're good. It's going to present a good matchup for us. And we're going to have to be locked in on defense more so than, you know, the first couple of rounds. Now, you said Maryland is skilled, big man. They got a lot of them. So does Kansas. I mean, does that help that you guys are maybe able to counter numbers as far as that goes? It does. And, and you know, everybody has to be ready uh, for foul trouble if there is any. And uh, we will be. Yeah. It's going to be a fun challenge. We're going to be going at it. It's definitely, you know, a lot of talent on both sides. And, and it's going to be, uh, it's going to be fun. Throughout this season, Lynn, and maybe through your career, you guys have seemed to step up and maybe play better against an opponent that has a name, that has a brand. And Maryland is certainly here. Can you speak to that? Yeah, I mean, at this point in time, uh, it shouldn't matter. But obviously, you know, maybe uh, subconsciously and stuff, the name does help, you know, it gets you up to play, and, uh, and you know, Maryland's a big-name school that's been the Final Fours and had great years, and they're having a great year this year, and we know that they were a favorite to begin the season, and, you know, still picked by some people, and so, you know, we're all going to be locked in, and, and we like, you know, we like hearing how much talent they have and whatnot, because it's a challenge to us to go out there and, uh, you know, show how good of a team we are. Lyndon, they're coached by the Topeka guy, yeah. a KU guy. Who's played and coached at KU. Um, will that play any part here? What do you think? Um, you know, I'm sure a little bit. He probably knows the program, and because he went here, he's probably followed. Uh, Kansas a lot more than some other schools, you know, just watching games as a fan. So he probably knows a lot about our team, um, but that's okay. Around this time, you know, uh, it, you know, we we all have the same amount of time to get prepared as a as a player, and so we'll be ready for each other, and, and it'll be. I, I think it'll, it'll present a cool feature to the game, but we'll, we'll both be. Equal. You got it. Maybe where's, give where's, us where's your, your, thought, your thoughts. Okay, he, so he just got the foul. There he is. Oh, no way. And then there's Church Tech checking in right next to himself right there. Oh, that's hilarious. Give a comment on maybe the shorts they wore, the style of play. That was a nice little and one coach, huh? See his free throw. I need your comment. Oh, and he made his free throw. Okay. I need your comment on how he has more hair now than he did. <laughs> I don't want to comment on that. We'll just leave that one alone. But uh, yeah, no, that, that's a nice little matchup right there. Okay. Have you seen him play before? I had it. I've seen him take jump shots and, and uh, you know mess around in practice, and he and he has a nice you know, little stroke. And I could tell you he could play, but I mean that, that was nice. He had the finishing skills and everything. So too. more respect now. You got, you got more respect. For yeah, I'm gonna let him know. I'm gonna let him know. That's pretty. That's pretty nice for sure. <laughs>